Hey guys, it's Kim here. Um, there has been a request on my supplements video a while ago, or that I did a while ago, and there's one person that asked, I can't remember the uh, name of the subscriber or the name of the person that commented, but I did say that I would kind of go over on how I mix my powders. Um, because he seems to find his a little too strong. So I do have two shaker bottles here, both filled up with water. So both of these, like of course, when I was a beach body coach, uh, I got this one with Shakeology. Um, this one goes up to 25 ounces. So I have it filled right up to the top. And right here, you guys won't be able to see it, I don't think. But it says 25 ounces. So that, this one I use for my pre-workout. And then this one is about the same. Except right here it says, I got this at GNC. Right there it just says 20 ounces. But I kind of consider if it, the numbers went all the way up, that would be 24, 25 ounces. So this one I use for my recovery. And I am using a different brand of powder. Right now, I'm not a real fan of the flavor my recovery is in, but I love my energizer right now. So I am using the uh, EHP Labs um, Aqua, Aqua, Oxy Shred, I should say, uh, in Java Paradise. So that's the, um, that, this is my energize right now. So what I do is I still use a full scoop of this stuff. And I know a lot of people say that it, like, on the directions it says you're only supposed to use, like, 10 ounces of water with it. But I find it would be too sweet. And I know a lot of people think that it's a little too strong to use that much. So that's why I use a full shaker bottle of it so of course I just dump all that in and so the other thing that goes with this is this little thing that kind of shakes up the powder so that lays right in and a lot of shaker bottles come with like a little silver thing which my GNC one comes with instead of like this so of course I shake it And that's what it looks like all shaken but it's still like you will still taste the flavor of it um, of your powders no matter how much water you put into your shaker bottles you will still get that same taste or flavor that you're supposed to get but I just find with this um, much water it doesn't make it so um, sweet because I find that if you go by how much water it actually says um, to drink with it, it I just find it too sweet or too strong like some people say so that is my energize so that's ready for when I before I go and do yoga which I'll do downstairs um, but then my beyond BC by the same brand um, it's in the color mango I don't mind it it's just there's a weird taste to it. It tastes kind of like there's creatine in it. Um, but I don't think there is. Um, doesn't look like it, but I think it's just, it gives me that kind of tingle in my tongue, I guess. I don't know. Um, I'm not going to say I don't like this. Um, I'm just not a fan of what it, um, the taste of it right now. I guess I haven't drank this enough, but I've, I'm almost done this, so I still have quite a bit of this left. And I think in here, um, I maybe have a quarter of it left, if you guys can kind of see. I don't want to dump it, but that's how much I have left of that one. And then... If I would have filmed this with my um, camera and tripod, it probably would have been easier to 
so but then that's how much of this I have left so I still have like half of a container left of this but um this one I think you have to mix like 12 ounces and I still use like a full bottle just because I don't like it too strong and this way I still I still get the benefits of it just with a little bit more water so of course I still take a full scoop and I dump it in and the thing that shakes my uh, powder is already in there so that silver ball in there it actually shakes up that so I will put the lid on and I thought since I have to do one I might as well do both so then you guys can actually see my two powders I use now um, I still have my um, BPI sports powders but I'm almost done those and I just kind of kept them because I like those flavors so the ones I'm using right now I have to order them online because I'm not sure if our supplement stores carry them I know GNC doesn't carry this brand but I haven't went to Popeyes or supplement world yet to see so hopefully when I'm done them I can actually check and find out if they do I know they carry I know Supplement World carries more BPI Sports, so I may just go back to that one versus get ordering these online, although I do like the flavor of my Energize, because I can actually drink this twice a day. I can drink it right in the morning on an empty stomach, and then I can also drink it again in the afternoon but no later than um, 5 p.m. so if I'm gonna go to a do another workout like go sw lane swimming or aqua size or both I can still drink one more before that as long as it's before 5 p.m. so I'm quite happy about that but for now I'm gonna stick these two powder drinks into the fridge so that they stay cold because I right now I am having a coffee <laughs> so anyways um I am starting yoga on Monday I am gonna start that Monday I'm gonna do a 30-day challenge and do swimming lanes and I'm gonna do aqua aqua um, fitness as well so that um, I can try that out and so yeah i am gonna drink these powders and finish them up and then i'm gonna try and get some new ones and we'll go from there because i have a whole cupboard full of my supplements downstairs so that they're not taking up this cupboard or this pantry so i have them downstairs because that's where i stay is the basement's my um my responsibility because my bed's down there my office is down there except when i'm home alone or like it's just me and my uncle i bring all my stuff up here so anyways i'm just gonna do my day planner for next week and everything and i will film hopefully once i get used to how i want to film i might wait till i can go back to the vertical setup of um the erin condren which i really liked because i can actually use each three areas as something so it'd be a lot easier to plan out my day in my week I found um I don't know where my old one went I wish I had that um but my second one I actually got was an hourly one and I didn't like that Leo um so now I ended up getting a horizontal one back in March or April around there so my uh my plan is around like November-ish, ordering myself a new one and my cousin or my brother's girlfriend a new one. So that's like part of her Christmas present. So that's my plan and hopefully she'll be happy with a new one. And I should probably text her and tell her that, that I'll get her another one for Christmas because she'll need another one by December. And that's what I did last year. I got her that for Christmas and and then I got her uh, 
kind of like a Clarisonic, but it wasn't the brand Clarisonic. It was just a kind of a lower end um, Clarisonic brush. But yeah, anyways, I'm going to stop that this video right here and I will try and get it posted. Bye.